Today in math, we'll be discussing the derivative of the natural log function. We have the function y is equal to the natural log of x, and we're trying to find what the derivative of y is. Namely, we want to find out what dy over dx is equal to. So one way we can start is rewrite our function equation. When we have y is equal to the natural log of x, if we take e, we know that e is equal to itself and raise the left side of e equal to itself to y and the right side of e equal to itself to the natural log of x, we find that e to the y is equivalent to e to the natural log of x. Now, e to the natural log of something is just equal to something. So we can write e to the y is just equal to x. Now let's take the derivative of both sides. So we have the derivative of e to the y. The derivative of e to the y is equal to the derivative of x. Now the derivative of x is just dx. And the derivative of e to the y has a very special property. Um, it's equal to each, it's, the derivative of e to the y is equal to itself times dy. So we get e to the y times dy is equal to dx. Now once again, we want to solve for dy over dx. So in doing so, we have dy over dx is equal to 1 over e to the y. But now, when we look at the equation that we got before, we have that e to the y was equal to x. So we can rewrite this as 1 over x. Therefore, we can conclude that the derivative of y dy over dx is equal to the derivative of the natural log of x, and that's just 1 over x.